हाय गाइस वेलकम टू कोड आर्टिजन लैब दिस इज वीडियो नंबर 27 फॉर मल्टी वेंडर ई कॉमर्स वेबसाइट इन जेंगो विद रिएक्ट जेएस करंटली वी आर डिजाइनिंग आवर लेआउट्स सो रिसेंटली वी हैव कंप्लीटेड इन द लास्ट वीडियो आई हैव कंप्लीटेड द विश लिस्ट प्रोफाइल चेंज पासवर्ड नाउ इन दिस वीडियो आई विल वर्क ऑन द एड्रेस एड्रेसेस लेआउट सो एज आई टोल्ड यू इन द इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो दैट वी नीड टू वी नीड टू वर्क इन अ थ्री different perspective for the address one is a uh, add address and then we will show the list and then we will mark as default okay so let's start with the address section right so here we have a okay let me uh, let's uh, close after the sidebar everything close to right no need for checkout no need for orders dashboard yeah uh, sidebar and app.js okay so first of all we will make a list for the address right so what i will do i will just copy any of the let's say profile i will copy this profile copy this paste it here and i will say here address list right and this is the address list and uh, what i will do i will do here address list right and then we have a uh, i will copy this and paste it here this is a component okay so uh, let's remove let's remove all these things from here no need okay and let's include this in our app.js right so copy this paste here and let's say addresses okay and we will here as we will say address list okay and similarly we will import this from customer panel okay so this is address list and paste here all right so if i click on this oh we need to update the sidebar okay so copy this and paste it here and let's say what we have added addresses okay addresses so uh, this is address sys okay so when we click on this it is showing nothing let's add the layout that so we will show the as a card designing let me show you so this is row and in this row we will create call for okay and in this call for i will create a card and in this card we have card body okay and in this card body we will show the address so i will show the address let's say uh, 1 2 3 uh let's say nyk let's say punjab let's say india okay let's say street number 2 new new let's say krishna nagar punjab india okay so this is the address uh add more things near 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 jain temple near jain mandir like this okay so this is the address okay uh, let's add we can also add h6 let's see how it will look uh, h5 let's see no need h6 is fine and one more thing let's add text muted okay so this is the address and let's add the shadow here uh shadow no need for shadow this is not looking nice okay so this is the address and we can add more address so let's add here margin bottom 2 and let's add here 2 3 4 5 6 okay so these are the addresses do we given the margin bottom 2 margin bottom we have given why this is not in the right way 3 margin bottom 3 uh, what about 
yeah this is the, this is nice okay so margin bottom 4 all right here we are okay so this is the list now let's make this one address is default marked as uh, marked as default so what i will do here uh what should we do let's uh, do um, card table info so what it will look like bg info okay so it will look like this okay so if we say bg secondary it will look like this then we have to add text white okay let's remove this text muted okay so this is our uh, default address okay so what we need to do more let's add here one more thing anchor f a f a uh, check circle okay so yeah this is fine so it means it shows that this is this address is selected all right so this is checkbox circle or we can do one thing let's remove this uh, bg secondary let's make it as it is okay so and let's uh, give the class text success all right so this is selected address okay so but uh, this is not look very nice Mm, 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 mm. we can do one thing let's add this in the h6 <coughs> sorry here okay and make this small make this small and uh, we can do if we add a break tag here what it should do okay so this is the okay this is default okay we let's add one more thing let's add then one more thing here let's uh, add s6 so here let's add a button hmm? mark as default let's add a button okay uh, not exactly button let's add a badge okay so this is make default i will say make default so it will be badge bg dark and we will say make default and it will look like this okay and let's add one more thing let's add some margin margin bottom let's say two okay and uh, here we are okay so this is make default and uh, mm, 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 mm. mark default mark and uh, let's do this as a button not as a span tag let's do this as a button okay so let's add button 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 outline dark and uh, button sm mm, this is uh, xs no we have a sm i think the badge was a nice idea badge is a good idea okay so this is our uh, things right so this is selected address this is mark default so we can mark this default okay and this will show on every address let's make this secondary uh, no need for here okay so when user click on this it will mark as default okay and user can select only one address as a default address right so let's copy this card here 
oh the same issue okay no problem here we are okay so oh, oh, which one is not added uh, mark default here what we have copied card we have copied card okay paste here all right uh, mark default mark default mark default not added here oh let's add here success and uh, add here fa fa check circle i all right so this is not looking very nice let's remove this span actually and make it text success okay so this is looking nice let's add try to add 2x uh, yes this can work this is over not matching with the all right so now we can do margin bottom in this success so this means this is default address this means we can make this default address right so this is the section for address list now let's add a button before these addresses we can add the button for uh, <coughs> adding the address right so we can add the buttons okay <coughs> so let's add before the row let's add here let's add here button actually not button let's add the link link to currently let's make it empty and uh, link and here we will show add address okay and uh, we will add a class class will be button button and uh, button outline success okay and uh, give a margin margin bottom four not here here okay and uh, let's make it uh, on the right so float end oh okay let's add in the row actually so two rows one is for button and another is for columns right so why this is showing okay all right we need to if we add this in the row then it is taking full space all right and if we add call 12 okay so let's see how much space is this taking all right so now this is fine okay let's add one more thing uh, let's add a icon f a f a plus circle okay so add address all right so we can add the address if we add simply plus then it will look like this okay let's add a circle every button will make circular okay so add address and when we click on the add address it should open the add address form so let's create the add address form add address all right so let's create the add address so i'll copy the profile again paste here and i'll say add address dot js okay and uh, what i've changed nothing okay so let's uh, add this add address copy 
paste and here we will say add address and we will just add the text area nothing else we just need text area okay so let's add here uh, we will say address okay and here we will say text area form control is fine last name uh, don't need the type this will be address label for address this is uh, text area so it will be text area okay so when we click on this it should go to add address so let's add this in a app okay so here is address list and this will be add address paste here and the address list and let's say add address no add address here and we will say add address okay so when we click on this it should show the add address section okay on the addresses and the add address okay so this is now we have completed the uh, we have completed this section also okay change password profile wish list orders dashboard okay so we have implement everything that we need to uh, that we need in the uh, customer dashboard okay now we will move uh, to the seller dashboard we will see that how uh, what seller can do and uh, we will implement those things okay so thank you so much for watching this video please uh, subscribe this channel if you are not uh, subscribed yet and uh, like this video share this video and if you need the project of uh, this uh, if you need the project then please join the membership okay join the membership of this channel so i will uh, i will provide you the access of this code from the github all right so thank you so much and uh, also you can download the uh, django projects or uh, uh, php real, php framework uh, related projects from projectsplaza.com this is my official website and i have also uploaded the lms system so if you purchase this uh, from here then it is also support for me or you can join the membership so this is two way uh, i can provide you the project okay so thank you so much for watching this video when when this project will complete the multi vendor then i, I will upload to here okay and uh, i can provide but if you want to learn along with me then you can just join the membership and i will give you the access so you can you can see the code uh, you know you can see the code along with me and uh, you can learn okay so thank you so much and uh, let's meet in the next video thank you